but it's delicious. <sighs> Jenna has picked me up. Look at this freaking pimple, dude. Oh, Harlow had a pimple in the same spot this morning. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Twins. I couldn't see. It was too dark in there. Mm. Mm -hmm. So we're heading up. Um, okay, let's talk about your dry bar, your dry bar experience. So uh, she was on her way to dry bar just to like check it out. Yeah. And um, Faith and Brooklyn, all three of us, three people. Yeah, check out the competitors. I mm -hmm. guess she's opening. Um, uh, yeah, you tell them. You tell them. You tell um, them I'm opening a hair extension bar, but we are going to be doing shampoo blow dries as well and like styles and all that so we just wanted to see what the dry bar experience was all about and yeah um i wasn't impressed which is a i wasn't either i basically told her i was like the last time i went there like i left with like wet hair and i paid extra because i had extensions and i ended up like leaving with like wet ass like yeah refs. like we weren't going to like bash them we were almost going to like okay like what can we learn from them yeah. But instead, we learned what not to do. Yeah. Unfortunately. That sucks. I'm sure they're not all like that, but that one in particular, we didn't get, all three of us did not have a good experience, so. Yeah. Well, that's bummer. bummer. Um, hopefully it tastes better. Yeah, hopefully. Because it's a little more permanent. I was about to say, <laughs> well, I know Davina is awesome. So yes. Davina does my injections, and she is really good with, like, my type of lips. And when I say that, I mean, like, smaller, um, my this little peak right here is very like um, defined and a lot of times I end up with filler in places it shouldn't be so she actually dissolved my fillers a while ago I don't know if you guys remember that but um, I looked insane for like two weeks like I looked like somebody just smacked me in the face with like a baseball bat <laughs> but, um, got rid of it all and she's been doing my injections and I haven't been able to have any since I was pregnant and so it's yeah it's been like over a year so this will be fun and then it's not cool sculpting but it is but what's the other one m sculpting m sculpting yes so we're going to um God, i don't know the name of it we're gonna, we'll, we'll, we'll find out when we get there yeah um but yeah we're gonna do tandem m sculpting which i think is supposed to be like the equivalent of doing twenty thousand crunches and it hits a part of your body that you can't do with regular exercise so it burns fat and builds muscle at the same time so Basically, it's it's a unicorn. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be too good to be true, but we'll I see. know I'm. We're gonna wait and see see what happens. But um, I think they're gonna talk to us about cool sculpting too today and figure out where we should get things done. Okay, sounds so, good. Yeah. Were we supposed to bring any like special like underwear or anything? Because I didn't bring. I don't think so. I think yeah. you just like fold your pants down. Oh, we're both wearing black leggings too, which is perfect. Yeah. Um, I think you just like fold it down and they put like this like belt around you and it just like contracts you. Huh. And okay. then, yeah, I don't know. All right. I'm not wearing underwear, so. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I shaved my uh, Punani yesterday, so. Oh. I think your uh, pew pairs are going to be out and about for. I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm just going <laughs> to keep my pants on. <laughs> well, I think it depends what area you're doing, I guess, right? Or is it just your stomach for Emskold? It's just your stomach. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's just your stomach, like the front part. This, this is good. I don't think I have that diastasis recti or whatever either from being pregnant, so that's good. Um, I well, did some testing on myself and I'm what good. What is that? It's like when your um, your ab muscles, I could be Oh, wrong. separate? Yeah, the separate. Yeah. Um, and when you work out, it ends up making it worse. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I actually, I've stuck my fingers in there. Like I watched this video that like teaches you how to figure out if you have it or not, and I don't. So good well, to go. We'll be able to ask all the questions today, which will be good for everybody because I feel like we all have a million questions yeah I don't I I'm curious to see how it works it's like mm -hmm. electromagnetic pulses or something that like make your muscles contract is what I'm guessing yeah this will technically be like the first like kind of like beauty thing that I've done like treatment really mm -hmm. besides hair extensions yeah that's pretty cool else. You never done like um my uh we well, did microblading I guess oh that's true microblading but, but I feel like that's a tattoo and I've already had tattoos yeah that's kind of different um have you ever done um what you call it um the facial thing where they like inject the like the blood and no, all the the vampire facial yeah I haven't done that either I feel like that seems really unsanitary yeah it kind of grosses me out yeah I don't, I don't know if I care that much like rub blood all over my face. <laughs> So creepy. <laughs> oh 
Is that too off? Yeah, that's off the floor sometimes. No, that was comfortable. Is this better? Okay. So. This is like a pelvic floor thing that we're playing with. It's gonna <laughs> make me pee my pants less when I laugh. <laughs> pelvic floor thing. So it's comparable <laughs> to like 20,000 Kegels. Mm -hmm. um, awesome. In 28 minutes. This is Davina, by the way. She's amazing. Hello. She <laughs> owns this, um, what do you call it? Skin canvas. Med spa? Med spa? Yeah. Skin canvas aesthetic. She is a rock star at lips oh, and Botox oh, for sure, you. too. I love you. <laughs> yeah. um, okay, so. Is she going to feel it right away? Yeah. So, <laughs> well, basically, I'm going to put it on like a trial one where it like just clicks so that I can position her in the correct spot. So then once you get it and you're like, okay, it's in between, I would say like your, your butt and mm -hmm. the front of your vagina. <laughs> <laughs> my anus? Yes, I'm like, your, I know. Your nacha. Like, my butt For guys, it's like the, <laughs> the, the taint. <laughs> the or nacha. Gooch. Yeah. Like, it's not your butt hole, but it's not your. <laughs> the nacha. <laughs> the nacha. I've never heard that. That's You've never one. heard that? I'm like, no. That. The nacha. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna hurt or like it was like what is gonna happen. I hope I'm recording. Yeah, yeah, I am. the red things on there. Like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's a little interesting, and then you're like, is everyone in here watching me do this right now? <laughs> <laughs> you're like, uh, I kind of feel a little awkward. Feel a little clicking, and then you gotta move yourself either if you feel it towards your 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 urethra. Sit on top of it. Yep, you want it right in the middle. Oh. <laughs> Feels like someone's taking a little glass hammer and like hammering my poontang. <laughs> a little glass ha hammer? Glass hammer, yeah. Like Opposed to a steel. Oh. So is it more. Wait, metal? are you pushing so you up or is it, it pushing you up? If you feel it in your it's butt. Doing this. If you feel it in your butt more, then you need to scoop back a little. If you feel it more towards the front, you need to scoop forward a little more. I feel it right in the middle. Lean, that's perfect. Lean back. Lean your 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 body back. Do you feel it more now that way? It kind of feels. It's hard to tell because it's such a small space, you yeah. know. Mm -hmm. But I, it feels like it's between all of it. All right. Does it feel like a rubber band? No. Oh. It just feels like it's contracting. A rubber band. I'd be like ah ah. Okay. <laughs> so it doesn't hurt. Just left Davina's. My lips are done. They're a little bruised um, and it takes a while for it to kind of all get into place. I got some Botox and then now we are heading over to do the M Sculpt, right? Mm hmm. Yep, M Sculpt and I think it's cool sculpting console. This is the machine. So supposedly we can, well, we can both lay here and then this like contracts your muscles. So it's like, a crazier workout than you could ever do at the gym, supposedly. Helps burn a little bit of fat, but mostly tones. So we're gonna do this. <laughs> and I can't hold this while we're doing this. You can't have like the cameras doing the machine. So let's check out how my bruising is going. Ask, mm. I'll ask them for Clint to come in and do some video of us. Oh, uh, that'd be cool. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So that was interesting. What did you think about it? I liked it, it was kind of fun. Yeah, you start off like at zero and then you can go all the way up to 100% and it's like the intensity of like the pulse. And 
we went all the way up to 100. We did. We were champs. But we didn't do it till like a little over halfway through, I think. So we just kind of like crept up and crept up. Mm -hmm. And it's just kind of weird. It almost like you described it as like when like you're like laughing really hard and someone's yeah. tickling you. Yeah, like tickling you, but with like little pokies. Yeah. 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 I wouldn't say it hurt. No. It was, it was a weird sensation in the beginning and then you get used to it and that's not a big deal. Yeah. But At first we were like, there's no way we can get to 100. I know, that's what I said. I and was then like, at the end we were like, yeah, go for it, turn it up. Yeah, go. so that was pretty cool. Um, and you can do it what, like once a week? Yeah, I would do it again for sure. Yeah, so you can do it like once a oh, week. Oh, we didn't ask how much it was. Oh, I'm curious, yeah. They um, did that complimentary for us, which was really nice. So thanks Brooklyn for Thank setting you. that up. Um, right now we're gonna go to a place in San Clemente, one of my favorites, it's called Nick's. Um, I wonder for, why it's your favorite. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they have really good food, food, good cocktails, um, and we're gonna see if we can get in there for dinner. There's no reservations available, but uh, we're gonna see if they'll seat us at the bar or something. Um, yeah, hopefully traffic's not too bad. We are freaking starving. Mm, that was a hard workout. That was such a hard workout. <laughs> Your lips look insane though. Like I'm just looking at you from the side. Oh, they look really good. They're bruised, but she does such a good it's job. It's so dude. good. Like the Thank side you. pout is insane. She does such a great job. And she uh, like totally numbs you up like with dental blocks. So you really don't feel much, which is just awesome. Not I meant to film at the restaurant. We went to Nick's in San Clemente and it was so good. Delicious. It was so pretty. We had such pretty food. Good ambiance. It's a good thing we good worked company. out beforehand because it was a lot of food. Oh, we ate a lot of bad things. <laughs> um, Nick just made us cocktails. That is well, mocktail, amazing. a cocktail. <laughs> um, yeah, he like blended up strawberry or like a this crushed like them up. A, like a starburst. Oh, that's a good thing then. Yeah, cheers. Cheers. And now we are watching the most dramatic the ever. Most <laughs> dramatic episode ever, ever. season ever. ever the bachelorette this has literally been a dumpster fire mm -hmm. oh i'm not supposed to purse my lips right now let me see if i can just shovel this in my mouth we got to say hello to harlita before she went to bed dad's putting her to bed right now and um we're gonna watch this uh dumpster fire and see what happens but uh until next time our next, we're gonna start getting um, facials. facials together. Yes. Not together, but like, she goes all the time. I need to get my ass in gear, basically, because my skin, you can't tell because this camera like blurs skin a little bit, it makes it look way nicer. But like, my pores, I, I just like neglected my skincare while I was pregnant. So, yeah. We're gonna do girls' night, girls' days. Girls' days. Yes. We're too old for girls' nights. <laughs> Yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, girl days. <laughs> Super tired. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I just also want to show you guys for off. I got a bunch of new rings mm -hmm. from Nordstrom so Rack. And I'll link you guys to all these because they're such good deals. They're all, like, gold-plated sterling silver. And then I just got these two also. And they're usually, like, 150 bucks, 90 bucks, And I get them for, like, 30 bucks. It's cute. This one on this hand, I think, is my favorite one. I like these two. These two are my favorites. Oh yeah, I really like this one. Super ones. cute. I like them a lot. And the green one. I do really like the emerald green. Yeah. I think that's like the color we're gonna do in Harlow's nursery. That wallpaper is insane. Oh, it's so cool. So good. We saw this wallpaper. So it's like squirrel. Um, we saw this <laughs> wallpaper in like Austria at the hotel, and it was so badass. If you watch my Instagram stories while I was in Europe, um, it was awesome. It's pretty expensive, so I'm gonna see if I can work out a little deal with them. But I want to do one wall of that, and then do like emerald green elements and what if you did it on the ceiling oh, the ceiling and one wall oh, and then like cool. a rattan like type of thing coming down from the ceiling oh uh, that's yeah i want that style yeah. in there too yeah that'd be oh, so that'd be pretty so fucking, let's see if i can afford it the fucking wallpaper is so expensive um <clears throat> okay back to the dumpster fire thanks for watching guys and we'll leave all the information in the description box in the in the d box in the d box like call it um you know, I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Bye.